can see a big low spot here, which is pretty common for these electrical outlets. We find that anyways, I don't know about you guys. It always seems to be a depression right the electrical outlet. And there's the low spots. Going with a team of people on a cement line wall. What I do with my guys because I'm often dealing with people who haven't quite got the experience to have the feel for the right thickness. So I just tell them to throw it in a little bit heavy at the bottom because then when I come to Derby, I lock in at the bottom and pull that heavy stuff up into all the low spots. So it's good practice. A little bit, a little bit thicker than it needs to be at the bottom because in the derby guy can just pull it right up. And if that doesn't seem to, because you can see the filling, filling in low spots is what takes the time, right? Mm -hmm. If you can minimize your filling, then the derby guy has a lot more time to. Help out on them. I'm applying because he's spending less time. Derby. So, Big Dave, my gunner, I always tell him just throw it in there heavy, don't worry about it. Let the Derby guy fix it. Satisfied more or less with what you've got there. Clean your derby. Now you want to go sideways. And you will see those spots. your derby 
or at least on that side at the low spot because you're going to pull the mud into the garbage, right? Even the smaller ones you can just spot in. Starting to look like a wall. So there's a high spot right at the end bottom. You can see where I ground it off. So that is flush with where we need to be, Good. just so you know. Again, we're not trying to go for perfection with one pass, but you can see we've already got pretty close. Yeah. We'll go for round two. We'll be in. Well, an easier time. I'm more or less satisfied with that for now. I'm going to 